Okay, before we get on to the region setup, uh, we're going to set up the money module now that we've got the robust.h, our robust.hg setup. And you've edited that file. Um, so you're going to have a folder called helper scripts in your downloads here. You're just going to take this folder and put it in your web uh, server. So we're going to really copy that. And if you put on XAMP, it's going to be C XAMP ht docs and then you just paste it in there once you've got that in there um, go back to your folder you need to edit two files inside of here so the first one is under config in the config.php uh, you're going to edit that and here you're going to change this to your url of your of your server uh, so it would be your a record or your ip address there this assumes that it's uh, under XAMPP HT docs and this is just defining where these helper scripts are located here you're going to set your uh, database for your robust here you're going to put the username for your MySQL and your password here you can change this uh, secret key if you like just make sure that you remember what it is because you're going to need it um, in the money server dot INI uh, which we're going to set up in a second so once this file set up save it and we'll close and then you're gonna go under include and you're gonna set up this config PHP and you can do the same thing just edit this 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 and add the same information as you've done before if you really want to get fun you can just highlight over it like this cut copy and and do the same just kinda paste it right over top so you don't have to edit it all over again so once that's done, uh, we go back into your robust folder, which will be here. And under bin, if you push M, you're going to see moneyserver.ini. Uh, we need to edit this. So once you go into here, you're going to put the robust database here, your robust username for your or MySQL username and your MySQL password. And further down, you're going to set the UUID of the banker. Uh, you don't have to. You just leave it. Um, but then anybody can get money. So what I do is I just go into the create a new user and then copy his UUID in there. Here is where you set the secret access key that we set in the config PHP, which in this case is 7007007. Uh, so we can just put that in there. And I've left that there already. So you don't you can use this if you like or you can tr change it but just make sure you change it in both those configs and the money server um, so it's the same number. Here you will put your IP address to the server. Uh, you can get it by going to CMD typing IP config slash all uh, but most people would know their server IP address so you just put that in there. And then you save it. Uh, next step is to install the certificates. They're going to be found inside of here. One's called server cert, and one is sine wave cert. So you just double click on them. Uh, this one will install without a password. And just click, click, uh, click, click. Uh, this one here has a password of one, two, three. So you just, you know, if you try to install it without, see, this is incorrect. So you just you know, put one, two, three in there, and next, and it'll install. So once that's done, then you need to take and copy the money.exe. So just put uh, moneyserver.exe and you're going to copy that to your desktop. Okay, so now that you have that. Now, providing you've set up your helper scripts and everything and you've configured your robust, like in the previous video, you can go ahead and start robust by double clicking and that'll start up uh, without any errors, providing you've done everything correctly and all the uh, IP addresses are, and FQDNs are set right. It shouldn't be too hard though. It's pretty easy to get, get it all set up if you follow the video. Uh, and then you start your money server. So first the robust, then money server. Once that's done, uh, we can go ahead and start working on setting up the, the regions that are already pre-configured. So we just have to change a couple things. And that'll be in the next video. Thanks for watching.